Alrighty, 11 more days to Blade Show. Getting down to the wire. So, uh, today, we're going to take a step back. I've totally skipped Migron knives when I was hitting up the letter M of the alphabet. Which goes to show how long it's been since I've paid attention to the order of the letters of the alphabet. <laughs> but here is my favorite Megaron thus far. Uh, and I've had them for a good couple of years now. This is the Megaron Curex. It is a titanium with sweet, sweet milling and a front flipper that works really well, as well as the speed hole for those spidey flicks has beautiful carbon fiber up there kind of as an inlay to create a, a fake bolster that also kind of breaks up uh, from the uh, frame lock bar so that you don't end up putting too much pressure on that to open it especially if you're a lefty so yes beautiful knife extremely well done and amazingly well priced the Megarons the next one that I picked up, which is a little bit newer to me, but I've still had it for probably a good five or six months. This is the Pegos 2. And this is a very clean looking titanium handle scale. Uh, both both uh, knives have the M390 for your steel. Um, beautiful, beautiful titanium with some micro milling. Check out the video on this because I get up close and personal and show off the milling that's inside of the milling on this handle here and the strangely beautiful texture that it creates. It's really, really cool. And the little bit of blue pops just, just enough. Give it a little bit of color. Makes it look really classy. Very classy. Frame lock M390. Beautiful knife. Love it, love it, love it. All right. Now we can move on to the peas again. And I've got a couple of petrified fish. Here is the scholar and it is it is really nice. Look at that warm cliff blade shape. And these wood scales are gorgeous. They look so good. And I like the color, the darker color of uh, anodized titanium here. Um, that color and the crown, uh, the I mean the backspacer's crown. It's rolled over, so is the blade. And it's rolled over. Um, really, really sweet knife. Very classy. And then the last one is quite a popular one. Many people know about this guy. Another front flipper. Um, it, but it's also got a large, well not large, but a long um, groove close to the spine. So. If you're good, you can get your fingernail in there and flick it open like that. I can't do it like that. I have to slow roll it. But uh, anyways, this is the mini beluga. The beluga. And it's smaller form. And it is so good. It's really, really nice knife. And the, uh, the swirled G10 here looks oh so pretty. Oh so pretty. But that's, that's what I got for today. 11 more days. 